So we made it to the Wollonga uh, railway station and this is what I'm assuming used to be the station building. We'll go, let's go up on the platform. Um, it is raining. I don't have my rain jackets. Looks like it's now a recreation centre, which is cool. Um, I assume this used to be like the platform and the station building and stuff. Um, and I'll turn you around. I'm assuming, like, if you come in, you can see straight down there. I'm assuming it used to be tracks. And then like down there as well. Maybe used to be tracks, maybe they were probably actually here. Because of the, the platform, <laughs> that's what I was looking for. Um, but yeah. Go down this end of the platform, that little pony club. Yeah, I definitely reckon this was like, maybe even the ticket office here. So cool. So cool. Um, railway station was opened in about January 1912 and it was the original terminus of the Wollonga Rail railway line which ran from Adelaide railway station in the city where we were the other day to Wollonga. <laughs> um, so I think about 16 intermediate stations and it was closed past Hallett Cove in the late 1960s, I think about 1968. Mm -hmm. Um, and this is what is left of the Wollonga station and you can actually do God, what it's called, like the rail trail or something like that where you like drive around and you follow all, you follow the old railway line um, but yeah this is really cool this is my little explore for the day okay it's really windy sorry I've just been reading this little sign here they have a word but I can't remember what it is um, and it was reading about like the train services and stuff and it said following the opening of the line two passenger services ran daily between Adelaide and Wollonga with journey from about two hours the last passenger train ran oh, in May 19, 1957 and a goods train ran once a week until 1983 and following falling in demand of the railway the railway finally closed in May 1969 um, yeah, so the line, the railway tracks actually stayed for quite a while, um, and yeah, this, they were dismantled in May 1972, and so some 4,300 sleepers, I'll put the number on screen if that's wrong, um, were removed between Hallett Cove and Wollonga, 